Hey guys, I'm Ryan45678, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install the new version of Tale of Kingdoms. I ran into a little bit of trouble working this one out, but I finally got it. And I know I saw in the comments someone said that there was a new version that I didn't know about, so I found it, I figured out how to make it work. So, to start off, you need Magic Launcher which if you've seen my old video you know what that is but I'll provide the link probably no not a direct link but because it's for Windows or Mac but so I'll provide the link click on Windows or Mac or whatever that's add fly don't don't look at all this only go to the top right skip add download say file and for this tutorial I'm going to do it all at once not all at once but you know download everything before before I actually do everything you know so create a new folder on your desktop to put everything in actually you can go ahead and put magic launcher on your desktop not in a folder I already have it it's right here so there we go next you need since the 1.4.7 update came out uh, in the Tale of Kingdoms the new version is 1.4.6 go here download the jar for 1.4.6 client I don't know what would happen if you tried to do it for a server because I don't think I don't think Tale of Kingdoms would work for a server but I'm I'm not sure don't quote me on it so with that uh come on doop -doo -doop -doo -doop 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 -doop. come on so you just need this minecraft jar actually don't even put it in this folder you have to go to start for well for windows 7 run and app data dot minecraft I already have it in here so I'm not going to do it again but if you go to your bin there, here's the normal minecraft jar and I renamed this one the minecraft 1.4.6 jar so that way I know which one is which you can go ahead and close that once you put it in there um, your saves will still be the same they're still in the same dot minecraft folder so next need the tale of kingdoms mod and I'm doing this in a certain order because in magic launcher when you put it when you put each mod in there um, if they're not in a certain order it, it's like uncom incompatible so I found all the right versions of everything and I've found the right order so download that or save or whatever and then you can put it in here your folder and next close the add fly and next you need mod loader so I'll have the link um, mod loader wait for it wait for it skip add And then put it in your folder. And next, you'll need, well, you don't need this, but I think it's been recommended. So Optifine 1.4.6 HDUB2, which is the, just the newest version. Not sure what these are, they're just better PCs, older PCs, I don't know. But I just used this one and it worked fine go to it and come on there we go and once you say ah stupid pop up once you save that put that in your folder too next that okay oh yeah the thing that's different about this version 
this is a different mod, but this is the place where I found the download for it. So you need, for this version of Tale of Kingdoms, you need the Forge client. And this is the exact version. That's just happened to be where I found it. I was Googling it. And it just happened to be in there. So I was surprised that all this actually worked with Mod Loader. I mean, no, Magic Launcher. Because I, I've tried, uh, if you've watched my videos, I've tried to get the Mo Creatures mod to work, but it didn't, so because of the way the Forge worked, I think, but I'm not, I don't know. Okay, you should be done now. And then you can open your Magic Launcher. And go to Setup. I'll say new just for this tutorial. So tutorial uh, copy from default. I think that's blank. Yeah. And then all you have to do is add no not that. Where's my desktop? Ugh. Where did I put it? Is that uh what did I call that folder? A new folder, okay. I forgot to name my folder. Let's go to add. Wherever you put your folder. And desktop. New folder. Because I forgot to name it. Let's see the. Or dang it. I lost the order, but. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Just put them all in there. Adjust the order. See, it says not compatible, but I can fix that. Make sure you have all of these. See, this goes up. Okay, there we go. For some reason, this says no mods found, but it works, so... The order should be mod loader, the forge client, optifine if you wanted to use it, you don't have to, and then tale of kingdoms. Oh, forgot to select the jar. There we go. That's really important. Otherwise, it won't work. You have to select the Minecraft 1.4.6 jar, so go to select, click on it, and you should be set. Okay. And then log in, which you should know because it's your account. I can't do it for you. FML. <laughs> Forge Mod Loader. What a terrible acronym. No offense, it's cool, but. New World. Tutorial. Great everything will work just fine like Optifine eh. <laughs> ready ah yeah okay start new conquest I don't know the first time I did this it crashed because I didn't wait ex exactly a minute but then it worked fine so if it does that ah oh, what was that it was very strange. Okay, see if it works now. Sorry, it's probably lagging a little bit because this isn't isn't my normal recording setup. I usually have my my screen resolution down to the minimum because of lag. So you know, looks like it's working just fine. We're we'll going here. See if we can start. Um, Sign up a contract. It's a guild master. Sprint. Come on. Sprint, sprint, sprint. And you don't you don't have to keep watching after this. I'm just messing around a little bit. I hope this tutorial helped. Yeah. Have fun playing the new version of Tale of Kingdoms. 
thanks for watching guys see you soon I will be I will start playing Tale of Kingdoms more like I have episodes backed up but I haven't been playing it in a long time because of having to switch back and forth between the new version and 1.2.5 so you know haven't been playing it now I can so you can look forward to some some new episodes what the heck is that okay thanks for watching guys see you later